Just talking about files. I get a lot of people uh, because there was a uh, demonstration of a file hooked to a shaper, drug back and forth, and uh, it still would remove material after a while. I would even, you know, remove a quantity of material. What I have found is a couple of things with it. One is that as you're filing it along, you realize there's little pieces that build up in there. And I'm not going to bother making pictures and whatever. You know those pieces are in there. Now, if we're doing extreme accurate filing, we will actually file forward. We will clean everything out, clean all the pinnings out. And people say, well, you can't, without going back and forth, you can't position correctly. Well, you can. You start over again, you lay it flat on the piece, and then you go forward from there. Uh, there's a lot of techniques to doing this. Why do I do it this way? Why do I choose to not drag it backwards? Because I'm trying to do precision filing. I'm trying to do filing where I'm taking off a tenth, a quarter of a thousandth, a very small amount, trying to keep it accurate over a distance, and why do I think, even though uh, there was a demonstration that settled it for all eternity for some welders, about pulling a file backwards doesn't dull it, I have had the experience of taking a good file, and a lot of times I work with harder steel than a lot of people. A lot of people are just filing brass, aluminum, whatever. You're not going to get that same dulling action you will on harder steel. I have felt the difference. You can really feel it if you are doing accurate filing. You can feel the lack of bite. When it is a good file, you feel it bite in. Now, some people want to go to the extreme of taking a scraper and turning it on, doing little bits of scraping instead of filing. And that's neat. I just bought that tool. It's not where I'm going. Most of the time, um, a file will be accurate enough, but if you want to just use it for abrading things away, just for removing material, you're not trying to get it straight, clean, you just sort of want to remove it and get it somewhere close, I got no problem with that, and I think it's fine. I think it's a little bit wasteful, though, because there's quicker, better tools. There's a way to build the metal if that's what you want to do. If we're going to do this according to pounds of metal removed, this is the winner. This is the winner. I don't even mess with one of these stupid things. If I'm looking to remove metal and going to weigh it by poundage, get a nine inch grinder, get a good wheel, Cubitron, one of the other ones, something that bites in, makes marks. Don't mess with these toys. These are not for welders. These are not for garbage work. These are approaching the level of what you do with scraping, the level of what people do. You can buy garbage files that are no better than anything else, but a good file used by a good person, you can come really close to what you get with scraping and is done in the old world for the demonstration of training apprentices when they learn to do this stuff. And they don't let them draw the file backwards when they go away from there and they draw it backwards because they're not going to do, they learn that it doesn't work as good. You can feel it. If you don't believe me, that's fine. Maybe you're not that sensitive with your feel. I don't know. I know I didn't believe it when I first started this stuff. I didn't believe it. I thought it was phony. I thought, nah, nah, doesn't matter. It takes metal off, it's good enough. That's my take on it. Um, point being for me is not that you need to stop dragging it backwards. If you don't drag them backwards, that's fine. It doesn't hurt my file a bit. It doesn't hurt my feelings. But for some people that have never experienced the quality filing you can do, don't try and bully them into thinking that it's been solved, that we've somehow proven that dragging it backwards is a good thing there's a lot of evidence that it's not. And I don't have, it took me years of using the file before I realized how good it was, how good of a reality that was, after I initially thought it was BS. 
just give it a chance.